Hello everybody, I'm AJ the Hitman, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna talk to you about something that is very important for me. In fact, it's very important for everybody. As everybody knows, I am a coach on nutrition. I'm certified as a holistic nutritionist by the American Fitness and Sport Associates. I am basically a coach on nutrition on plant-based diet. I am not here to preach about veganism or try to convince you to change your lifestyle or your diet. The issue I want to talk about is something that concerns everybody around the world. We have seen for many years new products that come to the market. Many of these products are plant-based products, or vegan products, what they call them. I want to make clear that veganism is one thing and plant-based diet is another thing. You can adopt a plant-based diet and not be vegan. Do you know that? Plant-based diet is all about nutrition. It's what you are putting inside your body. What some people call vegan food, it refers to processed food. Like pizza, cheese, milk, like any other product that you can see in the supermarket. But I want to make sure that you understand that processed food is not something that I promote here. Even though once in a while I do eat processed foods such as pizza, milk, cheese, but it's because I do want to taste and try different things all the time. I do have a very strict diet as a personal trainer to try to maintain my body healthy. Many governments are trying to ban at making new laws against vegan products so they cannot use the word cheese, milk or anything related to animal products. These laws are dangerous and it's based on companies that are forcing our government to change the law for their own benefit. I want to show you on the next video what is happening in Europe and the law they try to pass. People of Europe, your favorite plant-based foods are under attack from Amendment 171. In the EU, terms like vegan cheese and oat milk can't be used for plant-based foods. EU rules are some of the most restrictive globally. Amendment 171 could be even worse. Everyone's confused about what it could mean. Coconut dessert in a pot, banned? Buttery taste, banned. Absurdly, it could become illegal to highlight the health and sustainability benefits of plant-based foods compared with dairy foods. Lactose-free oat drink, banned. Half the fat of dairy cream, banned. Half the carbon emissions of dairy butter, banned. Even this could be banned. Semi-skimmed non-dairy almond drink, seriously? If this passes, how will consumers find the information they need to choose plant-based foods for a greener, healthier lifestyle? Amendment 171 conflicts with EU policy, the European Green Deal, farm-to-fork strategy, principle of proportionality, and is inconsistent with current laws on food labeling and consumer protection. Choosing plant-based foods shouldn't be so difficult. Don't stop progress. Reject 171 today for our planet and for our health. Hashtag stand up for plant-based. Share this with your MEPs today. As you can see, this law is very dangerous and is forcing companies not promoting healthy lifestyle and a green planet. This is a violation of the freedom of the speech. Even if you are not following a plant-based diet, you should not allow things like this to happen because this is a violation of your rights. One more thing, if you don't understand the ingredients on the back, please don't eat that, that's not food. The right to know what we are eating is a human right. Food for thought. Please don't forget to subscribe, to hit the bell button for notification of oncoming videos, follow me on the social media, and please don't forget, maximum effort. See you next time, bye.